These Peoria Riverman highlights brought to you by Casey's General Store. Now it's played out to the blue line, and here's Rush, left point, wrists it in, wide of the net. Yakura grabs it, centering feed, loose puck, McGill shoots and scores! Aaron McGill against his former team makes it 1-0. Just over nine minutes to play in the first period. And the Peoria Rivermen score first for the second straight night. Dean Yakura playing the puck towards the front of the net. And a loose puck came to Aaron McGill. Now gains the blue line, leaves it off for Clulo. Shot from the slot, turned aside by Levine, who went down to a pair of knees. Second professional season. Here's Fayetteville in on a breakaway, and a backhand shot goes in by Clulo. And Fayetteville has tied this game at one. Playing heads the other way, quickly in transition. Trying to dance around Viola, and then he's laid out by Cole Rui. Penalty coming up. Rui doesn't like the call, but what a hit on Lang. In the left circle. Total well above 250 games as Peoria scores. Eight minutes to play in the second, and the Rivermen have a 2 1 lead. Tough to tell who even knocked it home for Peoria. Adam Hartley was there. And it's the 14th shot of the game for the Rivermen, which equals their second goal. Put Peoria back on top. As well, and now the other way. Here's Clulo looking for his second goal of the game. Shot from the top of the circle. That one's fought off by Levine to the near corner. Peoria 0 for 1 on the power play so far as Ambergate gains the blue line. Pass across. Nice pass to Stanfield, and he scores. <laughs> Parker Stanfield has made it 3 1 Peoria with under six minutes to play in the second. That extends his point streak to five games. And the Rivermen have opened up a two-goal lead for the first time tonight. Oh, grabbed for a second by Peoria, but then turned over. Elliott, a shot, and they score. Pass up to Lang, who stops it, then tries to flip it up and over Karkin, and Karkin lays him out, but a penalty coming up. Fayetteville zone, I should say, then taken away. And here's Larson in, shoot, scores! 10.33 left in the third, and Taylor Larson has made it a two-goal game yet again, and his fifth straight game at home with a goal. Blue line, Caravu throws it back in wide. Far side, played, here's Lang. Centering feed, a shot then, knocked down by Levine, and he'll cover up in the blue paint with 8.20 to play in the third. Richardson. Top of the point. Here's a shot by Reed that gets through. Say made by Levine. He's out of position, though. Thankfully, Peoria able to play it to the blue line. Play continues. Reed across. Caravu a shot, and he scores. It's a five-on-three goal for Fayetteville, who have made this a one-goal game yet again. And it's Zach Caravu. Six-on-five now as Fayetteville has pulled their goaltender. And this one's going to roll into the back of the net. And Peoria has a two-goal lead. For the third time in this game, they lead 5-3 on an empty netter.